。呃，不是不是不是，这这是做完有病。<笑> Do we look like professional, uh, porn barbecuers? Okay, so we are here at West Coast, right opposite Hopa Villa. Yeah. Okay, this is Otto. Okay, this is Otto. So this is part two of our East Coast versus West Coast um, adventure. So if you haven't seen the previous episode, go check it out first, and then come back over here. Okay. So uh, this place, there's a lot going on. Ah,、uh. there's prawning. There is. I've been here once to this waffle place to eat ice、ah. cream. Ah.、Uh, there is Thai food because previously this Otto thing. Is at Yishun, ma, but they moved yes, the whole、exactly. thing over here. So there's a lot more going on. So hopefully this can cover a good amount of activities, ah,、uh, food, and also can fight East Coast. Yes. So at the end of this episode, Zeme and I are going to make the decision on whether the East Coast is better or the West Coast is better. I wouldn't consider prawning as a sport, but there is this like. Escape room immerse experience thing,、uh, level two. So we we can go for that because yeah, that one is gonna be in, yeah that one is gonna be intense. So let's go. I have high hopes ah、uh, for the food here, the Thai food solid. Come let's go. So this one first activity that we'll be doing. I'm quite excited for this.、Uh, it's a immerse experience. I've never done like escape room or the puzzle solving thing, but I see right. These are like they have a bunch of stuff inside. There's like floor is lava, escape room, all the different stuff. And we're counting this as a sport. It is a sport. It, it, it's gonna be intense. Like, it's gonna be intense. Come, let's go. Let's go. Do you really think it'll be that intense? It's gonna be intense. Like can escape rooms kind of chill? No, no, no. And then intense on the head, lah.、Uh. How do you go in? What the heck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Intense. Intense. Oh, it's here. <laughs> oh, very futuristic, ah.、Uh. I don't think you just start straight away. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, don't you have to like register or something. Sorry, guys. I'm too sorry, excited. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. He he、excited. just walked in. It's not me, okay, no. Okay, guys. So we cannot actually go through this escape room. You need to book beforehand. So, but the owner very kind. Like, he let us come in and take a little tour. He just showed us around and it looks super cool. I would love to come back another、yeah. day to try it out. Let's head back out and hopefully we will be able to make it for our other game. I'm gonna play the floor is lava. Ooh! Wow! It is so cool. Floor is lava. Dude, this is so cool. This looks like some uh, what is that? The para para. DDR. DDR. Para para. Yeah, DDR. Okay, so Zeme and I have a strategy. We have split the split、yes. split the space into two. So it's easier. We will not bang into each other. Yes. Okay, I think we're beginning. Okay, so Three, you guys two, just、one. watch us. Okay, just okay. Start inside. Okay, okay. Wang Wuzhan, go get it. We finish the first round. Round one done. Okay, so far so good. Really,、okay. all these patterns could change. Ah,、uh. okay, now round should we, two. Should we still? Okay, I got one in the corner. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Nice. Oh,、okay. hey, this is teamwork. Yeah, I know teamwork. Okay, now so, it's level three. Let's. Okay, let's maybe. <laughs> no, sorry, I used up a lot of lives. Oh no! <laughs> Why? Wait, wait, wait. Behind got what? Okay. Did I kill? I died to kill. I'm sorry. No, we didn't. We didn't. We didn't. We didn't. We didn't. We didn't. We have two, we have two lives left. So every time you lose a round, they actually let you try again. Until you get it.、Like、yes. Spending it. Let's get it. Hey, my friend, you think we're done already? Oh. Yay! Chong already, just chong. Yes, we did. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice. Wait one second, eh, guys. One second. This, wow. This is not easy. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, I feel so accomplished for like no reason. It's okay. <laughs> I'm stepping I, on square. You should be. Okay. Okay. Wanna try ice cream? Oh yeah, sure. I I I tried this one once, lah. But on、uh, your date? Yeah, on my date. 
So oh. is this the same date as your East Coast date? Okay, so Zermatt recently came here for, for an actual date. Oh my god, it was freaking horrible. No, it's a different no, it's a one. Different. You make it sound I, I, I go out with a lot of different girls. Eh? <laughs> okay, what ice cream flavor you typically get? Typically, like, like Earl Grey or something. Yeah. I, I like to get something that is more like ambitious. Wow, there's yeah. even soya bean oh, milk and so fritters. What is butter beer? Yeah, I think I want to try the soy bean milk. Okay. Soy bean and then um, blueberry cheesecake. Okay. Can. Okay. Let's go for that. Yeah, so this is a uh, Dough fritters and soybean milk, oh, very which pretty. is sojang yu tiao. And there's actually yu tiao pieces yeah, in this. Yeah, there's yu tiao inside. Careful, Oh, wow. You can tell it's sojang straight away. It's a bit of vital soy. Wow. Not bad. I would never have thought that this would be ice cream flavor. Okay, I want to try my blueberry this good. Oh. I'm so surprised that the yu tiao actually works cold. You would think it wouldn't work if it's yeah. cold, right? But it actually works. And right, the blueberry is good. Also you know, good. Because, I can taste the berries very strongly. Because I see that this one left one scoop only. Oh, okay. Yeah. But okay, I think the the Tojiang Yu Tiao is the Still winner for me. Okay, so this is sort of like my recommended place and also an activity that I want to do because the last time I prawn right. It's about seven, eight years ago. Oh, so you've never been here? No, I never ever prawn here before. Yeah, I've been to the, the old auto. Yeah. Also. I love prawning, you know. So you I'm love prawning? Yeah, I'm super You don't know, like the prawning type, eh? Why? What is the prawning type? We got the rods already. Tell me. I, uh, what is, tell me See. what's the prawning type. The rods are here, the rods are here. What, what is the prawning type thing? Prawning tell type me. is people that look like Steven. The people that look like Steven yeah. are the prawning type. And then, a very long never prawn, you need to teach me how. Okay, so they prepare chicken heart for us. And they also prepared the worms. The worms, this one, they say this one's stronger. Uh, Disgusting shit. Sorry, uh, I think I got I think I got something. You got something? Uh, it it ran away! You didn't get anything. Uh, oh, yeah, I think you got something bro. Nice! How am I supposed to throw this thing at? Oh. No, you have to un you have to you have to take it out of the hole. Oh. Okay, well Steven's a pro, okay, maybe Steven can teach you. Oh my god, Steven just grabbed the prod. Oh my god, he's such a professional. Thank you. Honestly, you need a lot of patience. To, to be fair, I think that was, that was really quite a, a rare occurrence that you got it within your first minute. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm gonna get a bite. I'm gonna get a bite. Okay, is my, is my bait still there? Your, oh, your my bait, bait is, is gone. There. So, another prodding hack, guys. You must constantly check your hook if you're not getting a bite because it might be that your bait is completely gone. Might be a, a very smart. Smart pawn just bit away the bait and you didn't even notice. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, you got it? So oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going down. Yeah, eh, hey, but so small. Okay, not bad, nothing. <laughs> ah, okay, I got it. But the, the premium, premium one works, it? really works. Oh, wait, I got a bite, I got a bite. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Good job. Wow. Big one, big one, big one. Come on. Oh, I think you got something. Yay! Oh, I got it! You got one, you got one? Nice! So, mate, you should try taking this one out yourself. Yeah, I know, I'm a good try. You want to pluck out the, the claw first so that okay. it doesn't kill. Nice, then put it into the net. Yay. Good job! Yeah, so we need to wash and skewer the prawn. Yeah, so uh, the owner very kindly gave us extra prawns. So we got a gigantic bag of them right now. Steven's so just, still catching. Yeah, and Steven also still catching, so yeah. we might even have more later on. So let's wash all of these first and then we're gonna skewer them. Okay, yeah, we've washed and skewered the prawns. So now it's time to barbecue them. I think the heat is it? No, it's going in my eyes a bit. What is going on? The the charcoal. Okay, so we got some salt. But honestly, right, these are usually so fresh. Even if you don't put the salt, it will still be very, very delicious. <laughs> Do we look like professional uh, prawn barbecuers? I think I'm having oh. barbecue with friends. Throwing back to the days where I used to go potting with my friends. Yay! Okay, shall we eat now? Yes, let's go. Okay, 
Okay. I'm gonna pick this guy. I'm gonna do a small one. It's so fresh, right? That the skin just peels off yeah. so nicely, right? Let's go. Let's go. Wow. So good. Oh, so wow. you know it's fresh when it can just pull off the tail like that. Surprisingly, it's got very nice umami. Maybe you want to ping over charcoal. Yeah. Wow. The exterior got a bit of like the nice salt crusting from, from us salting the prawn. Okay, okay, look at that. Good, huh? You don't need any seasoning for this. Huh? There's some people put even more salt. So we didn't put that much. So the salt is very subtle, but it's so good. Correct. Right. This is the meaning of life right here. Hey okay, guys, so that is a Zhichao restaurant next door as well. If you guys want to catch all this prawn here, right? You have to bring it to them and get them to cook for you prawn fried rice or whatever. They can actually do it for you. It's not like you die die must barbecue. You can bring home also. Yeah, you can cook it in a different way at the Zizha store if yeah. you want. We're gonna finish this up and then see what we're gonna do next. We're gonna we're gonna eat. We're gonna eat more lah because yeah, dinner. We're gonna eat more. This, this is your prawn not because enough. Because this isn't really a food location. Yeah. We'll go. We'll go find somewhere nice to eat. Sweet. These are uh, all chef recommendations and it looks good. It looks so good. It smells good, it looks uh, good and I'm not gonna lie, I have very high hopes for this. And can I just say also, the atmosphere here is so nice. We even have lanterns because this place is actually a bit of a mix of Japanese cuisine and uh, Thai cuisine. It's not a fusion but it's separate kitchen. If you are with your girlfriend and she insists on Japanese food and you insist on Thai food, y'all can come here and make everybody happy. Okay. So let's try. Let, let's 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 try and we see if the food matches up to the atmosphere. Okay, this is what um these are prawn cakes, huh? Mm. Solid. The exterior is very crispy. The inside, right? It's very nice and bouncy. I like this one. I no, I do think I've had better prawn cakes. But it's good. Yeah. This one, this one is good, but it still goes a bit to the realm of process. Wait, before we move on to the next thing, I also want to talk about how I got my very first glass of Guinness beer here. I only drink Guinness. Uh. I don't drink regular beer. I've, ne I've never tried. Try it's it's very very frothy. May or may not like it. Hmm, it's not bad. You okay? Yeah. I'm gonna take a bigger sip. How? Can I? Yeah, actually it's okay. Okay, but I I do think that it's not that much different. Okay. From the regular beer, actually. It's creamier, la, I feel. Okay, uh. Okay, I, yeah, I think the pork belly is calling out to me. The skin, just look at the skin. Mmm. It's, it's actually quite tough. Yeah. This one cannot. This is a bit tough and a bit way too salty. Oh, is it? Okay, I. The saltiness is fine for me. It is just a bit too tough. I didn't like this one because it's, it's just dry and. It's really way too salty. It tastes a bit like cured meat, really. This one, uh, honestly, I've never had this before. A tempura looking kang kong. Good, right? The sauce is a, a cold coconut. Straw creamy coconut. Pork broth thing. That so it really complements the greasiness of, of the kangkong. That is like really good. I would eat this as a snack, you know. Let's try this one. This is the crab omelette. Omelette. It's really good. Normally a lot of the Thai omelettes I eat, they don't beat the egg to such like fine bits, you know? I, I kind of like the thing, this whole combination. But I find it might be a bit too oily for my liking because the, the floss is too too oily. I'm still gonna give this place a relatively high rating because of this. So we got an extra bowl of boat noodles. It smells really good. We we try without a condiment first, huh? Whoa! Oh, wow! Tastes very hearty. It's not overly herbaceous. You know, some soup is probably like very, very. The herb taste is too strong. This is okay. Yeah. But the soup has got a lot of heat, though. I'm not sure if you tasted it. 
it's, it's quite spicy on the soup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it, I feel the, the spice is quite slight. It's still enough for me. This is optional. If you find a soup flavorful enough, you know, add. There's chili vinegar, there is sugar, there is um, there's the roasted chili, and yeah, this is chili vinegar. So this one is peanuts? Yeah, this is peanuts, yeah. Should we do a pull of the noodle? I'm gonna get a piece of the liver. I feel it would be nicer if the noodles were chewier. Whoa. The liver is so good. I'm just gonna douse it. Yeah, actually the bowl noodle is quite good. Eh. Yeah. For me, when it comes to the noodle dish, it's the sauce and the soup. If it's, the, if it's a soup base, the soup needs to be very good because it's the one that's enflodging everything. But if it's the if it's a dry one, then the seasoning that they put on top needs to be good, like Tai Hua. Uh. So in general, out of these five dishes, which is your favorite? The the kangkong. The kangkong ah. With the sauce, this is still my favorite. I, I'm sorry ah, okay. I, I want to say kangkong ah. If this didn't didn't came out, okay. Right now it's boat noodle because oh really? Kangkong still feels like a snack to me, but the boat noodles is like a main and it's got everything together combined together. I really like it. All the organs tasted really good as well. So in general, how do you find the whole entire West experience? Actually, it was super fun. For me, right, the West, if anything, um, I wouldn't say the activities are super fun, but it's just the vibe. Like yeah. the overall vibe of the place. The vibe was so good. Oh, the vibe is so nice. When you prawn, right, you sit there, chill, chill, lay back. Uh, when you come here and eat, it's a very laid back vibe. You, you chill with your friends and everything. It's totally two complete different vibes, East and West. So West, it's got a very laid back kind of country kind of vibe, which I like. We're going to finish this food and we're going to do a quick recap. Okay. All right, we have come to the end of our East Coast versus West Coast adventure of the day. Actually, it was so much fun, you know. It was fun, it was fun. This doesn't feel like a very long shoot. You know, some shoots, yeah. after that you feel so drained. This one, I feel refreshed. Yeah, I'm actually really still so excited yeah. and I'm like, I'm, I'm still buzzing from the amount of fun we had the whole day. But we have to make a choice. Okay, so how do we make a choice? Are you guys write on your phone? Write on my phone now. I already decided. Huh? So easily? It's not that it's not an easy decision. Faster and then he give me up 10 seconds only. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, 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 no, wait, give wait, her 10 please, seconds. please. Ah! Okay, I'm just gonna say it was a very close call, okay? Sorry, ah, uh, sorry, ah. Uh. Wait, ah. Uh. Wait, 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 wait. Hey, wait. What is I just, good? I didn't, I didn't see your answer, don't worry, I didn't see your answer. I changed this like five times, guys. Three, two, one. Okay. I, I also it's so wanted close. This is a this is a forty nine fifty one percent for me. Let me let me. I got my reasons out. Okay, what's the reason? Like I said, uh, West is the very laid back vibe. Uh, somewhere that I personally would come. Nice food, um, cozy place, very nice environment. But inside the activity feels a lot more wholesome. Like I get to see the bird. Proper weightboarding that I've never experienced before, and all the activities that you you experience in is the cat club, the birds club. Yeah, it's, it's just, to me, this is what wins the thing. All the Westies gonna come for us. Yeah. I didn't expect it to be this close. And I think for me, it's similar, you know, because I feel like the activities here, a lot of it can be done somewhere else. So prawning, there's so many other prawning places. That's why I was so tall, because this, this was honestly one of the best prawning experiences I've had. And, because um, it's with me. I mean, I... I sure, okay? Sure, it was because <laughs> <laughs> I was with you. Strangely enough, right? The soya bean and, oh, yeah, and, and yo tiao ice cream actually was, was a big highlight for me today. And it was like an unexpected highlight. We just walked past it and we decided to try some. But either way, it was a very, 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 very close call. I'm looking forward to another adventure. Yes, I'm looking forward to going out and, and uh, having a lot of fun again. Honestly, I think out of everything we've done so far, I think today is really the best adventure of the day we've had so far. Okay, so we come to the end of this video. If you guys got any more adventures that uh, you want to suggest to us, let us know. Thank you for watching. Uh, you guys. If you guys like our video, please remember to hit the like button. Hit the bell notification icon as well, so you'll not miss anything. Mm. Okay, and drop us a comment down below. We love to hear from you guys. And that's it. We'll see you guys in the next one.